Hi everybody, I'm Dr. Joel Parker and this is Whiteboard Wednesday. This week we're talking about who's your bell cow. Now a bell cow is, uh, in the cattle sense, is a cow that wears a bell and wherever that cow goes, all the other cattle follow. And uh, it's just a leader. It's a person that is, uh, you know, in that case, in, in, in the herd, it's a cow that's got an opinion that we should go over there and everybody else follows him or her, most likely her, and off they go. Relating to this to your practice, your business, this is the number one client out there that loves you guys, that's a promoter, and wherever they go, they talk about your practice. You could call them the practice ambassador, but in this case, it's your bell cow, and the trick is to find them. You may have one or two or more. They're the people that really love you guys. In the end, actually, you should hire them to be on your staff, as we've talked about before. Hire your bell cows. Hire your, hire, hire your excellent clients to be on staff because they're like the ambassador of your practice, and that's what I did. More on that on the power team builder that we've talked about before. That's the two-day workshop here in Vancouver, Seattle, or Tampa, you know, on hiring your staff or hiring your clients and what to look for. But regardless, once you see that you've got some bell cows and every practice has got them, the trick here is to really acknowledge them. And when they come in to really sit down with them and say, hey, Mrs. Johnson, I just want to really uh, thank you for all your care and support that you've given our practice over the years. That's awesome. We've had so many people come in because they're friends of yours or business acquaintances. I just want to say thanks. And usually they'll go, oh, no problem. And then finally, what you want to do is hand them out some referral cards. These are business cards that say good for, you know, one comp exam or something like that on the back, whatever little gift you want to give, and that you can give them those cards and then they will hand them out to people. And if they're a, a truly you know, super upbeat, uh, positive person. They'll look at this opportunity and go, hey, thanks very much. I wish I had some of these before because I just talked to somebody the other day. Okay, so here's the trick. Right? Here's your action steps for today. Number one, locate your bell cow. Who's that person that refers into you a lot, that uh, just naturally does it, that gives good reviews, that talks you up? Secondly, acknowledge them so they know that you are very, very appreciative of all their help. And then thirdly, give them some referral cards or business cards that they can hand, hand out to people so that the people they hand them out to have got a phone number to call. Okay, that's half the battle. You know, even on referrals, you'll say if somebody refers you someplace, now you got to go onto the web to find the phone number and all that kind of stuff. Make it easy. Just have a very beautiful business card. Even consider the uh, the Viva Vets beautiful little plastic cards that we go over in the online new client builder workshop. That is is a as a beautiful little plastic card, translucent, really gorgeous and pretty. That gets custom made for your practice, and you hand those out. Okay, guys, find your bell cow. That's what we got for you this week. I'll see you next week, and thanks for watching. Thank you.